What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. My name is Chris. That's Mike. Yes, it is. What's up, Chris? Oh, nothing much, Mikey. Our names are on the screen. I always forget that, but I like to introduce us anyway. Woo Assassins! Uh, right. Yes, sir. We're here. We we're there. We're here. Um, our 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 buddy Lewis Tan. He's he's in this. Uh, yes. With a bunch doing of a other job, people. Doing a great job. Doing a great job. Yeah. Oh, it's a great uh, a great new series. You Ico know, where, Uas, uh, uh, um, C- Catherine Winnick. Right. Oh, I love, I love me some Catherine Winnick. Mark, De- Mark Dacascus is in it. There's dude. There's a lot of people in this. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Especially um, Stephen Fung is producing, yeah, directing is producing this. It. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Uh, you have. Yeah. Uh, there's a whole bunch of people. I wrote down some of the names because. Don't botch them. It's gonna be tough. I think they'd understand if we. <laughs> she Ma, I believe, has T Z. I'm so sorry. I'm I'm horrible pronouncing, um, pronouncing names. But uh, he he's he plays Mister Young. He's yeah. been in uh, RoboCop two. He was in Twenty Four. Like he was, yeah. he's been in a lot of stuff. Uh, yeah. So lot lots of lots of great actors in this. Um, yeah. Representing, yeah. Uh, representing uh asian actors of the world you know what i'm saying so we've got some really good stuff this is a really um so this first episode season one episode one called drunken watermelon this is where our hero his name is kai jin um he he's a chef played by eco and you know so we get to meet him uh, who else do we meet? We we meet uh, Jenny and Tommy, brother and sister. Yeah, the uh, the owners of the of the restaurant that uh, Kai's obviously working at. Um, we he was meet helping Lou. out. Remember, he was yeah. helping out. Yeah, yeah, he was helping. He was helping out. Um, I mean, obviously, Louis Tan um, playing Lou. Yeah. He, and then he, uh, he, yeah. Uncle so Six. so right. So Uncle Six. So we're getting we're getting. Oh, Uncle Six. His name, oh man, where's his name again? I, I didn't write his name down. Hold on. Uh, so, get that, on it there with your research. I know, I and I shut the page too. That guy's awesome. That guy, most recently, I've seen him. He's been in a, he's been in a ton, a ton of stuff. Mm-hmm, but mm-hmm. recently, seen him as uh, Takeshi Kovac in Altered Carbon, which is one of my favorite. If you haven't, dude, you got to watch Altered. If, if you guys aren't watching Altered Carbon, Altered Carbon on Netflix, also another another Netflix joint. Yo, you Byron Man, you have to you have to see him. He's he's really good. He plays he plays OG uh, uh, Takeshi Kovacs. He's awesome. Okay, so anyway, Altered Carbon. It's a book series. They're turning into that. And uh, Anthony Mackie's actually playing the same character, the lead character in the second season. And there's a reason for that. And you have to go watch it. Anyway, watch it. Great show. But we're what we're not talking about that. We're talking about Wu Assassins. So yeah, so uh, Byron Man, he's in that. Uh, Everyone was I. I enjoyed everyone in this in this series in in this episode. We got again. This was this was one of those episodes where you just kind of get to know everyone. You get to and you get yeah. to understand the story. Yeah. Uh, again, story. Yeah. Uh, to the story. Yeah, I just spilled. My I mean, water all over my desk. You, you spilled your water on your desk. That's yeah, not sorry, good. Sorry, go ahead. I'm so excited yeah. about yeah. War Assassins. I'm spilling no, crap. Right, listen, so obviously, like Chris said, um, it's a it's a new series. You know, us as viewers, we're just trying to learn who's who and and this and that. So Chris mentioned a lot of the actors that are in the show. Really cool people. Our friend Lewis is in there. Obviously, he's doing a great job. So the opening fights. Let's, I mean, there's there's a few different fights in here. The opening fight was really cool. Um, Chris and I spoke about this before. Um, about uh, you know, there, there's I, I guess it's Kai's um, neighbor, uh, one of the guys that also lives in the Mr. apartment Young. building there. Mm-hmm. And uh, after after Kai kicks ass and all this kind of stuff, he looks at him and he's like, "Like, who are you?" Like, so for me, I was like, "Hmm, what is this all about?" Right, because yeah. at the end, we finally get um, after Kai is given his his Wu pa- you know, his powers, and, and and he's the chosen one, which was very cool. Um, we find out th- through a re uh, a rerun of that of that fight scene. So that was like one of the really cool um, parts of this episode for me. Is just that we got to see it through the different perspective now of the fighters that are trying to go after him. Us thinking at first it was Kai, but it's really the old man. So I thought that was really cool. Well, it it is Kai. It just happens to be it's one of the monks. So this, well, yeah, yeah. Well, the- it's his face He's wearing. A face <laughs> wearing a different face. The it's story, like, like so the art. story, so the whole thing starts pretty quickly. Yeah, it, it very it very quickly gets into it, which I appreciate because listen, we've got enough. You, you have to kind of pay attention. So when Catherine Winnick, who plays uh, CG, mm-hmm. um, 
uh, her name, uh, Christine, what, Christine Gavin, right? So they call her CG. So basically what it is is uh, Kai is the, a descendant of the monks and is given the, what's it called again? The monks, uh, the monks the, hood. What's it called? The, the monk piece. Monk piece. So he gets that and he just very quickly is told, guess what? You just got the, power of a man. thousand monks. You're yeah, the chosen you're the one. You have to fight the Wu. The Wu uh, are a clan of uh, of warlords from back in the day who have taken over the power of the elements. Uh, what, what did we have? We had wa- uh, water, yeah, uh, fire, water, water, fire, metal, metal wood, wood, and earth. Did and we have earth, earth? I believe it was. Yeah. Cause, uh, so yeah, so they, and we see that he's getting attacked by a, yeah, a, a spirit of the, of the water and stuff. And it's like a water dragon. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so that was, right away, that was cool. yeah. what do you, so, so yeah, so he's, so he's tasked with, okay, you have to kill them. He's like, well, I'm not a killer. And the character who's walking him through this is his, his ethereal mentor. Her name is Ying Ying. Yeah. Which I, I like this character because she seems like she's really young. You know what I mean? She seems mm-hmm. like she's younger than Kai, which is interesting to have I, I, I always enjoy if you guys hear banging I'm sorry, I don't know. My wife is upstairs painting and stuff, I guess. I think she's tap is she tap dancing tonight? Uh oh no no no, that's on Thursday nights, yeah. Oh, so, yeah, okay, no, okay. Tonight. But um <laughs> so yeah, so they so I just like when younger characters or younger looking seemingly characters are the are the guides. I like that. Mm. Uh so that's I mean I, I it just appearance wise, she just seems like a younger person. Oh, no, I think definitely. But there's something, div- you know, it's like a, a, a limbo. It's a different altered consciousness, whatever it is. So it's like, it doesn't matter how old she is. She doesn't need to be, you it's, know, it's a, Right, a it's what that old. entity d- 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 decides yeah. to appear to Kaya's, right? Which, again, yeah. which is what I like. So, so yeah, so right away, getting off, you know, it's 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 fantastical. It's, it's it's uh, you know, it's it's presenting what this series is going to be. He gets the power and everything. And, yes, his part of his power is... Not not only able to you know kick more ass than he already has because I believe he already knows, you know martial arts and stuff prior to this. Mm-hmm. But it's now he's got more power, and he yeah. has the ability to. The monks will hide his face for him so he can get yeah. the job done, which is yeah. which is a pretty interesting thing. And Mark Dacascus happens to be one of those monks. Mark Dacascus, one of my favorite martial arts movies ever in the world, um, Only the Strong. Okay, it's one of my favorite uh, Capoeira movies, and uh, he was just recently in John Wick Three, so he's he's still around and 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 dare I say kicking and also punching. So really good to see to see him in in this. And uh, yeah, I mean it was again not not a whole ton of stuff happening, but we've got the foundation. We get to meet the characters. Now here's something interesting. Again, I was saying a little, I started to say a little earlier. Pay, you got to pay attention. So like when Christine Gavin was you know introduced at the when the when i guess it's like vice right and they're doing the briefing and the and yeah. the captain guy's like okay so this is this and this. so basically lou works for the triads under uncle six however lou is also going he's over to the yeah, to the russians, the russians right the russians yeah, right so yeah so they're they're trying to keep track on that which is why cg yeah. is going in to infiltrate that so it's just like it's like they don't pull their point it's like just put everyone where they gotta go mm-hmm. i appreciate mm-hmm. that this is a 10 episode season yeah uh you know so 10 to 8 to 10 is a good is a good 13 can get a little much like some like daredevil and jessica jones like those got a little much when they hit like 13 episodes 8 to 10 i think is good i think 10 is really good because you can get a couple of these episodes where you got to get the story down and the characters out and then you can focus on the stuff so i think 10 is a good a good uh, a good thing I agree too. Um, I mean, last but not least, really, besides besides the you know the fights, um, oh, one quick thing: the the fight in the in the uh, in the the vendor, the truck. What do you call them? The, the street, the roach street, coach, uh, yeah, the roach coach. Yeah, yeah, that was. That, I mean, that was cool too because it was such tight quarters, and Kai's fighting these two guys and uh, hitting them with fire extinguishers and stuff like that. It was it was um, reminiscent of Sunny fighting in in the RV? And, oh hell yeah. You know, it's kind of close quarters kind of a thing. So um, that's a Badlands reference, if you don't know. Um, but but badass. And then like uh, um, like um, in the final scene of episode one, we see the two guys that got their asses kicked going back to Uncle Six. And um, he's obviously not happy with them. 
and we see him playing with fire like in his hands and these guys are like fascinated by this and like oh my god what is this so then we obviously know right off the bat that guess what yes uncle six has has this ability he's the fire the fire guy and he incinerates these these two guys because oh. um that's because, well, because that's what he does. Uh, that's what he does. Oh, yes. uh, yeah. Also, uh, Kai happens to be the adoptive son, the adopted son of yeah. Uncle Six. That's that's. Yes. So it's not necessarily, you know, so he calls him his son and he's like, I'm your father. But he's like, you're not my father. You know, my father got me to this country. And he's like, yeah, well, I took you in. Yeah. And I trained you and whatever. And so, yeah. So, so that's that's who he and did we find that out in the first one i think we did um sure da, 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 da. i don't know if he visits and because he i think in the second one you you get that scene that you were just talking about all right so maybe i'm maybe i'm mixing up a little but anyway that's yeah we, but that's what we find out we, but we do find out that yeah we know that he's re, he's related to him in one way yeah. or another but you know that's what happens but anyway yeah so good stuff um yeah. Obviously, this was just a foundation episode, and you know, you know, we're just getting to know everything, and and they're setting the the, the ground rules for some of the stuff and in the characters. Yeah. So, you know, uh, we're gonna you know get get you get the second episode in, and uh, yeah, we will just keep going from there. So, I'm I'm liking it. What are you liking it, Mike? I'm enjoying it. Yeah, I'm enjoying it uh, quite a bit, and I have a lot of fans um, of the Badlands uh, from coworkers and friends and stuff that are really enjoying it too. Yep. I don't want to compare the, the two because Badlands, there's such a, I mean, we have such a like a like a loyalty to you know to to a to a degree, and and we just love that show but so much. Fine. So it's you know, obviously Stephen Fung also worked you know on on Badlands too. So there Badlands is and there will be some Badlands, comparisons, yeah. and I'm sure a lot of the fans of of Badlands are watching this, especially with because of Lewis and because it's another kick-ass martial arts um, show. So um, yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Um, I'm excited to get into it more. I'm trying not to watch, even though I want to really binge them. Um, I'm trying not to watch so many in a row because I want to kind of go with how we're recording. You want to focus, it. yeah. So here's the schedule. Here's yeah. the, here's here's the idea for our schedule for for the Wu Assassins. Yes, everybody can binge it and it can be done. We get that, but yeah. we we would like to d- do a little more deep dives into that into each of these episodes as opposed yeah. to as opposed to just blanketing, just be, you know, binging it, it and then giving like giving you a fifteen minute video on it or a half hour video on it. You know what I mean? Like we want to do like we did for Badlands. We want to break them down and we want to talk about yeah. them. So we're so you're gonna get the the plan right now is to get you two a week. Yes. Um, I think we're gonna, you know, we're gonna try and get out two a week at the very least, one a week, uh, because we are also doing the the Terra on AMC, um, which, is, which is pretty good, yeah. Yeah. So, that. so if you haven't, if 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 you you know, go watch that and watch our reviews on that because we're doing that too. So, so like I said, so we're we're trying to do two Boob Assassin episodes a week, and which reminds us, we should probably tell Lewis that because we ask us, oh, what do you want? And we and we're like, oh, well, we were only in episode two I, right I now. Actually, I actually hit him up yesterday. All right, yeah, I know. Yeah, I told him that we're really enjoying it. He asked how far along we are. Um, I told him that we're going to be doing the re- these reviews, and and he's he's uh, he's pumped and he's excited that uh, that we're checking it out. So hopefully, and, we're going to get him it. back on here, and he's going to be able to talk about his character and the rest yeah, of the and yes, the rest sir. of the show and stuff yes, like sir. that. So that's so that's right. a, that's in the works. Uh, but that's it. Wool Assassins, we've been waiting a while for this and yeah. just happy to have another another martial arts vehicle to, to that that's readily available for people to watch and yeah, and it absolutely. has some of our favorite people in it. So we're very, very excited. So uh yeah, good stuff. Great stuff. Good stuff, great stuff. Yes, uh, guys, uh, write in the comment section below how are you enjoying Wu Assassins? Um did you binge it? <laughs> uh let don't us tell know us what that. happens. Yeah, don't 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 spoil anything exactly. Uh, but check us out at all the uh, social media outlets at Third Person. We're all all over the place. Um, like Chris said earlier, too, we're doing the terror. So check that out. So we'll be posting stuff usually on our Instagram that we're doing this. We're posting this live. Uh, so you guys can just go to YouTube and check out uh, the reviews that we're doing on the show. Um, again, thanks for everyone that's watching and supporting Third Person. We're uh, really excited to get into uh, one of these uh, new Netflix series. So thanks again. Watch us. Check out Wu Assassins. Check out Terror. Peace. Peace.